So there was a video posted on the Microsoft Game Dev channel regarding some updates to the Xbox Cloud Gaming platform that should interest many players who play on the platform, including myself. This video goes into details about several various upgrades that are about to roll out soon, but I wanted to talk about the two that might matter the most to regular players. One of the big things for me was mouse and keyboard support. There are many games on the platform, especially FPS titles, that would benefit from this. Halo Infinite, Back for Blood, Fortnite, the Battlefield titles, you name it. Now when can we expect keyboard and mouse support? It will light up in streaming when we finish adding it. Thank you for that very specific date. Now the majority of the video is about reducing latency because it's always been an issue for me, at least versus some of the other platforms. Other platforms like GeForce Now and Stadia have always seemed to have a snappier response time versus the Xbox Cloud. They are fixing this by introducing the direct capture method. I'll let him explain. So what we've recently added is a direct capture path. And the idea here is if a frame is compatible with direct capture, which we'll talk about what that means in a minute, then it can go through a software implementation of all of those hardware features. And it's a whole lot faster, somewhere in the 2 to 12 millisecond range, instead of all of that time over on the right. So basically, this method eliminates the filtering the current process goes through to get the stream to you. This would save up to 72 milliseconds in latency. This would change reaction times in so many games. Being competitive on Xbox Cloud might actually be a thing now. Overall, I have to say I love the transparency here. Other platforms could take a lot of notes here. <coughs> Stadia, <coughs> Stadia, <coughs> excuse me. Now I'm glad Microsoft is aware of their streaming issues and is openly talking about the changes they plan to implement. I highly recommend you go watch this complete video. There are a ton of tidbits Morgan here drops regarding higher resolutions, sharper visuals, and tools that are coming to test your streaming compression. So check that out, and if you like this update on Xbox Cloud, give us a like, and feel free to subscribe so you can get the latest news, gameplay, and comparisons on cloud gaming at the only place where you can do battle in gaming heaven, Cloud Gaming Battle.